Alrighty, we are back with another sheet improvement. This time it's from James from the Better Band Bureau. Love better things, because this is better sheets. Um, and let's get started on this one. I'm not going to go through every single sheet. We're just going to change this schedule around. We're just going to make it look a little bit better. Um, so first we've got to make a copy. Um, it's going to be really, <laughs> really confusing because it's going to be better blank tour sheets. Um, but his, it's the better band bureau. So better sheets, let's call it. Um, so it's not as confusing for him or you. Let's see what we can do with this. Uh, right off the bat, I see that he's already, it looks like he hid the grid lines and then added some, but, um, we're going to make, let me move my face over here because here's our schedule. Um, God, where, where do I start? First, I would just delete all these, um, extra things. Ooh, we have some data down here that we didn't even see. And look, this is one of the pet peeves of mine in sheets. Whenever I have a sheet that I know exactly its length, kill every other um, column, every row, um, so you don't get into this abyss of sheet. This is like... I have nightmares about this stuff. Like, where am I? What row am I on? Where's my data? Those kinds of things. So we, that's the first thing we're going to do. That's just a pet peeve. I do shift command to the right arrow. And it's going to go super slow because this is a big sheet, it seems. It, you can hear my computer ratcheting up. Um, ratchet? Uh, you have these interesting things here. So we want to keep those. Let me um, delete everything down here and that's just a couple of keyboard keystrokes there that I've put to muscle memory it's like shift command and down arrow or right arrow or up arrow wherever you want to go all right let's see oh grid lines are on that was confusing all right we'll turn those grid lines off first off get out of the here all right, we have a schedule, we have date venues. So this is interesting because it is, James is helping bands. And this this is an advertisement for his podcast. It's a tool for people that are bands that are wanting to use this. So we have to consider, we really want to make sure his um, branding is full and full of branding and we can click this. See, like, here's an interesting problem. We can't click this link, and we want to click the link. Like, I'm, I'm trying to physically click, click the link. Um, one way you can fix it, we're going to come back and do more, but we can just combine, merge these cells, and now we can click this link. So this is a new thing where, this is a new thing in Google Sheets where you can select just some text. Let's go here and take a look at what he's doing here, um, what it looks like. We have this great green color all around. Is this everything? Um, let's see what this, without the listen, what's his, we have this black, this green, this white, these great colors. Let's use these colors in that promotional sheet because maybe this is going to be sent for free. If this is sent for free to bands, we definitely want to put our branding all over the damn thing. If it's being sold, we want to be a little. We want to limit it a little. Ah, great! So it's white with this green um, logo. This logo looks nice, um, but this this image pops out at me. And I wonder. I wonder what we could do. This green play button just like screams, "Click me!" You want that? Okay, I'm gonna grab this. I'm gonna. I'm just going to copy the image address for right now. I think this. And I'm going to put this up here. He wants that podcast. He wants people to listen to the podcast, which is fine. Let me add a row. Let me just see if I can just insert a row. I want it background white. I'm just going to see what this... Um, this image is going to look like here. Equals image, and then I have that uh, 
in my clipboard. Man, that's a lot more readable. Um, but he, let's let's do something fun here. Let's get this color first. When I get this color, I want to make. I want to make the text in this color here for better band listen and I want to um move I want but this is really cute right so what's going to happen is this covers what we need to use so a lot of people are going to be pissed about this link so let's give it a little more room um I'm thinking about a whole lot of stuff here let me pause and re come back all right so this is very um, personal. Hi there, James from Better Brand Bureau here, and you can listen. Well, I found on the Better Brand Band Bureau his photo. We really, if we're going to be promoting this and we're going to say, hi, it's me, James, and not hide behind this Better Brand Band Bureau um, logo, we want that image. So let's, I'm going to replace this with image and need a parentheses here. Let's replace it with this nice image of James. Um, I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna do something crazy here. I'm gonna insert another column. I'm gonna bound this because this schedule is very important. But this branding up here, we're gonna, um, we might be able to use this branding in other places. So I'm gonna move this over here. And give it some more cells. I'm going to move his image here. I'm going to make everything white. This blue is not part of the Better Band Bureau. And this will create a nice, clean uh, white background. This um, borders. We're going to do something special with these borders. I'm going to grab the green uh, color here from his... Um, logo and we're going to figure out what that is and then we're going to use this border okay so um i just got the url of the image and so i got this here and all we need is this color code right there Bam. i think it's going to be this let's just double check it um is correct let's put it right custom here. Okay, nice. So now we have our custom color. Okay, what are we going to do with this color? We are going to change the um, border color. So right now, border color is that. Um, I got, it. got it lost a little. So we're going to also thicken it up. Did it change? Nope. Did not change the color. Let's try that again. There we go. Ooh, that's sexy. Ooh, that's sexy. And now, if I do that all the way down. Okay, the top we're going to make thick. But this one, we're not going to make as thick. Ooh, that's sexy. Ooh, that's so sexy. Now... Now this text, ooh, now we got to do something about this text. It's Times New Roman, it's 8. Um, let's make it 10, at least. We want to make these a little wider. Ooh, we have this weekday. We can do this. Let's see if that helps. Oh, that doesn't help at all. <laughs> um, let's move these to the center. And also, I'm going to center them here. Why? Because it looks a little cuter. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to actually, I'm not going to pick this color. I'm going to pick a custom color that is, what's the um, complementary? Let's just use a very, very light green. Super light green. On the yellow side. Let's try that. Ooh, now that's sexy, right? Ooh, baby. We don't need a colon there. We can actually make this all caps schedule. That's what we need. 
And Times New Roman, all caps, does not look good. Let's try Oswald. Ooh, baby. We are pumped. Let's make that even bigger. 20, yeah. Oswald's good because you can make the super big text size. Let's see what happens if we um, do Oswald as well. I love Oswald. Yeah, it's it's readable. Let's try 12. There we go. You know what? I don't like that these are um, on two lines. So let's do that. Ooh, yeah. Let's even... I bet there is probably a reason you have more here than the rationale. But these probably could all be the same size. Probably. And let's make it... Just a little bit bigger than that. There we go. Now, this looks just a lot sweeter, right? Um, we can move these all around. This is this looks printable. We want to print it. Let's change that from... Um, I don't want to use Oswald. Pirouette, that's really hard to read. Let's increase that size a little bit. We're going to center these as well. Center these as well. Center them on that way too. Oh, yeah. Um, but this pirouette, we gotta figure, do we want to do Oswald? Not bad, right? That looks a little bit better than the other sheet. Already, we look a little bit better than the other sheet. But let me do something right here. I want to decrease these a little bit. Because this isn't what we need. We need to do 10. Okay. And let's increase this just a little bit. Boom. Nice. Harder to read. A little bit harder to read here. Totally fine. Um, because we'll know these eventually. They just look good. We just needed to have it look good. We can actually, you know what? Also, I'm going to take the gridding off of this. Ooh, that's sexy. And then also off of this one. And I'm going to bound this right here. So we just need the border on this side. There we go. Now that looks a lot better. A lot less lines. All of this here too can absolutely be changed to like less text. We have this photo here. Let's move this all the way. I want to move this here. But I'm just going to grab this... Um, text and I'm going to move it right to there merge those put that text in there nope you know what I'm going to unmerge those I want I want that text exactly like that there we go now all we're going to use this second row for is a little white space because this is going to have our branding it has better brand band bureau here's James I want this all the way over here I want this like that. I want it merged. I want this on the right, and I want this on the left. So let's mer put that. I want those right next to each other. I want James to be in this image. Everyone should see this. And this actually should be a face, right? I like that it is him in front of a console. It looks like he works for a band. It looks tiny. That's the only issue I have here. I would replace this with, like, a face. Um, I would also replace this. I would go into Photoshop put a little circle around it, make it a circular thing, or make it this shape here. That that might be too cute. Um, but I would definitely use an image here as a different um, shape than uh, straight lines. I would I would either do the a circle, I would I would prefer a circle, but and I would pr prefer a big face, but I get, you know, maybe you want to punch in on that that console and him. Um, didn't do much change here, but definitely can t cut down on this text a little. Um, I'll do that right now. James from, hey, James from Better Band Bureau here. Maybe I'm James from Better Band You can listen to our podcast all about improve, maybe make this a little more improve your fans business let's do our podcast there we go that 
changed it. I'm going to add a little, some, a bit of space there. That's fine. We will increase this a little more because it's a promo, right? If, if this is being sold, I would make this super little, like tiny. But if this is a free schedule, I would make this big. I would also change this probably. I'm going to change it to Oswald. But it doesn't look cute enough, right? We have some other ones, probably oh, Comic Sans. Oh, God. Oh, somebody cringed while watching this video. But yeah, I'm going to go with Comic Sans there. <laughs> That's a bit of a fun thing. I would cut this down too. I would maybe make it a, add another line. Ooh, we can do that. Insert a, one above. It's going to be the same size, but I'm going to make it super tiny. Um, I might even do this. This is weird, but mm, maybe put it on underneath here. Change that a little bit. Hmm, wanna merge all that. That doesn't look good. <laughs> I'm gonna undo all that. We tried. But yeah, we've cut this down. Uh, James from... Maybe cut this down to two lines. Oof. Let's see what... Does that fit there? Maybe. I would, I would try this a little few more ways. This is... Or just increase the size a little bit. There we go. Make these pictures a little bit bigger. Maybe make them a little bit smaller now that I think about it. Um, yeah, so we made a bunch of changes to this. But just visually, everything was in the same place, same spot. We brought that... This might even do better. You know what? I'm going to try it. I'm going to just do that. I'm going to make the text white. There we go. Woo! That's sexy! Ooh, that's sexy. We can even make that even bigger. Oh, yeah. Um, let's make this wider. Fit that. I think these we can even fit in a little bit more. We're not all the way out of the viewport yet, but, yeah, we can do that. Now, that looks awesome, right? We've improved that. We haven't messed with this at all, which you can absolutely probably want to do something like this with white text and make it like super big. Maybe make it like, um, can do Oswald, but we're going to have some issues there. That total mileage. I want to fit. Why doesn't that wrap? There we go. Wrap it. We can pop this to there. Total mileage. We can also move. I'm doing. I'm doing this. I'm gonna move this and merge these, so that looks a little nicer. This all here could probably go up somewhere here, next to the schedule or under it, or it should probably go on a separate sheet, like a summary or something. But this probably has some printable need for it, so we might want to keep it on there. So I'm not gonna move it. All I did was move that this one over one just to give this a little, little more space, um, give these two. I would actually also do that and move that even over one more. Um, there we go. And have this probably over here. Yeah, we can do a little bit more, but this schedule looks sexy. And we hopefully have improved it. Bye.